Couples are renewing their wedding vows on this Valentine's Day during a group recommitment ceremony. This is especially timely for a few participating couples who never had the chance to do this before. Our City Beat reporter Mary Mills joins us from live joins us live rather in downtown Indy. She's got the details. Hi, Mary. Hey, Scott. You know, it is snowing like crazy out here, but not even that can stop Cupid. Uh, folks have been showing up here the city county building and the clerk's office to get married all morning long, while earlier there were a number of couples renewing their vows at City Market. This is the second time for that ceremony, a group ceremony with the mayor leading the vows. And this time they wanted to make sure that all couples were welcome to take part, including gay couples. And there were three gay couples renewing their vows, all of whom said it was especially meaningful. Uh, given yesterday's Senate vote, which essentially means that that marriage amendment will not be on the ballot come November. I mean, it's a holiday that we typically are not big celebrators of, but to come and do this is really important to me for two reasons. One, of course, because of everything that's happening in the state right now, looking at HJR 3 and whether or not we're going to add that amendment into our Constitution. But more so, it's just that it allows us to be part of kind of the world in our relationship in a way that in the past we've not been invited or even allowed and certainly not welcome. So to be here today and be part of all these other couples and have it just be a non-issue is tremendous to me. And as we said, the clerk's office, a busy place today with 65 couples signed up to get married. The fee is 50 bucks. All of that money does go to the American Heart Association. So a very good cause and a memorable day. And I guess, Scott, you could say love is in the air and snow is too. <laughs> We're live outside the city county building. Mary Mills, Channel 13 Eyewitness News. All right, Mary, thanks so much. The snow continues to fall.